No, Mark, uh, unlucky to be on a losing team today. Yeah, obviously we're disappointed. Um, that's a good side, and you know we had a game plan to, you know, try and stop their better players from playing, and you know, and then you build on that and try and you know create our own chances. And you know, for most of the match we did that. We frustrated them. Um, we limited them to probably their only chance to have scored. Um, and you know, the keepers made three, four really good saves to keep us out. So it's really disappointing. You know, considering you know they're top of the Premiership, you know they've went and beaten a really good, strong Celtic side last week. So you know to go and put a performance like that, you know against a good side, it's 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 encouraging. But you know we're we're, we're gutted that we didn't get some of the game. So you know it's, it's it's a positive in the end that we can probably take from the match. Yeah, good incentive coming into the game to test yourself against top of opposition, and you prove that you can hold your own. That's it. That's that's where we want to be. Um, you know that's the level we want to be playing at. That's. You know, so we've got to be, you know, looking at these teams and you know try to match them and you know see if we can get to that standard, you know, for next year. So, you know, if we can put that performance, you know, in against uh, teams in our own league, then you know, hopefully we won't be far away. You know, if we, you know, compete in the Premiership next year. Uh, back to the regular defensive lineup today with Danny Devine coming back from injury alongside the captain Lee Ashcroft and yourself. Uh, you're beginning to gel together, but you weren't really tested overall by Hearts. Nah, I think we I think we, we dealt with it well. Um, obviously the, the the big boy up front so you know is a strong lad so we you know we didn't try and get involved in the battle and you know it worked in our favour because we um, we just let him have it and you know when he tried to uh, you know hold the boys off you know you could nip in front and steal it. So I felt the three has done really well today and you know missed Dan last week with his presence, he's a big strong boy. You know, so um yeah we we'll just keep Building on it, um, getting stronger as a back three, helping the midfielders and the wing backs, and you know, hopefully we can, you know, hopefully we can have a wee uh, luck next time and have a clean sheet. The Hearts goal when it came through a pair of legs, Lee Robinson unsighted, just unfortunate. Yeah, you know, it's a hard one. I can't really remember it. I think it, I think it does go through uh, Big Dan's legs. I'm not, I'm not 100% sure, but it's just one of the things. It's unlucky and. You know, on our day, maybe it gets blocked and we clear it, and maybe we Eden puts it in the back of the net and we win one 0 So it's it's unfortunate, but you know, like I said, there's, there's positives there to be taken, and you know, we have to take the positives and you know, just think about next week now in the league. As you say, Aidan Connolly came very close in the last minute, and the keeper a couple of good saves from phase before that. Yeah, you know, he's, I think we Aidan's just had to hit it, and you know, the keeper's just a reaction. He's made a great save from Big Dan's header as well across across him. So. Uh, yeah, we're, we're unlucky in the end. It's, it's disappointing not to get something from the match, but you know, like I said, it's positives now, and we've just got to be thinking about league campaign. Been playing on a few fronts, of course. League campaign's a priority. Uh, still in the Iron Brew Cup, a nice trip down south to look forward to. Yeah, obviously the, there was a you know a, a young squad that went up to Inverness the other night, and they, you know I watched it. Um, they've done really well. Um, so you know, obviously the away trip to Bohem's probably no ideal for the. You know, for the club and for travelling fans, whoever goes will probably enjoy it. But um, yeah, uh, obviously the, the main priority, like you said, was in the league, and you know that's what we need to concentrate on now for next weekend. And his trip to the seaside next weekend down at Ayr, they'll make it tough. Yeah, well, I've, I think I've heard they've, they've won again today against a good side. So uh, it'll be a difficult match. They're, they're on fire. They've they've got a good bond. I've speaking to a few of their players, and you know they've just they're doing really well. They're working hard. So. You know, it's not going to be easy. We're not going to go down there and just expect to turn them over. We're going to have to work hard again. You know, even even harder than we did today, because you know, sometimes playing against a, a smaller a smaller club is is harder. So, you know, we need to be on the front foot and you know, making sure that we we're on uh, getting a good result next week. Thanks, Mark. Thanks very much. Cheers.